Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to our Making Moogles campaign in EU4 with me, your host, Lucky Marine. Oh my word, destroying the place. And uh, we're, we're cutting our way through Bamanis. It's a little easier than I thought it would be. I'm expecting to... Oh no, what have I done? I'm expecting to get hit by the Ottomans at any point. Okay. 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 Now you come back and re-siege the bits that they've taken. Cut down a little bit on the uh, devastation. I don't think I need to be here. Yeah, let's drag you along. This way. Oh, another conversion. Good. Muscovy is declaring war on no guy. Oh. We can convert this province. Usually when Seekism pops up, it's uh it's quite hard difficult to get rid of. For a good few years. Go and deal with the bub the Bahamamanises. The Bamane? The Bamani? B I don't know. What do you call people from Bamanis? Banat ba Bamanans? I don't know, I don't know. Answers in the comments. Uh, but yeah, we'll, we'll let him go deal with them. Homos has declared war on Oman. Homos has declared war on Oman. Did I see that right? Are you defending? Defending against Homos. Homos has giant balls. Anyway. You continue taking little bits and pieces back. Can we get you on here? We can. We're on a siege, on a siege. We don't need 15 there, do we now? We just need 6. So, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. The rest of you just step off. And let's split you. And you. And let's move you away. And continue. You carry on. And you stay here. We'll take this province back. Let Barman do the squishing. Local autonomy, that's fine. Uh, let's go help out. Don't know if we're going to get there in time. No, we're not. And we're already locked into it. Oh no! Disappointed. So we're going to end up down here somewhere. And coming back at us. We need to be ready for that. Let's lump some people together. As long as they don't get on our capital, I'm fine with where they where they are. So if you move, really? Well, well, we'll prep to support this if we need to. Also, manpower recovery speed. That's going to be good. Cost reducing war exhaustion. It's near the end of there. Let's split you a little bit. That's troop down here. I've got 13 stack ready to support this 10 or or this siege here if they uh, they come back at us. However, you're locked into here. Let's let's go, let's go support it. Good, good. 
Excellent. Uh, let's bring you down here. Until you sort your life out. That's almost pure cannon up there. You though down here. Okay. But honest, what are you down to? Just eleven thousand. Or you should be alright with uh, spreading out a little bit now. That's a fort will allow you to get onto that fort and then we'll take the bonus of being in the jungle. Superb. Oh, excellent. Fall some more. Minus one for terrain, minus one for crossing. Happy with that. Even with some decent rolls, it's going to take big losses there. You move in and you move in as well. As long as we can contain them in the south of their own country, we should have free reign up here, apart from the, the random cannons that got past us. Wow, well, took it on the 7%. Pretty cool. Where's he gone? Where's he gone? He was right here. Did he get squished? No, he's come back. You're already locked into there. What is it? Just hills. But it's not going anywhere. It's not on sieging anything. We'll take the back the bits that we need to here and we'll come back and fall onto this five stack and squish it. Let's go pile on it. Good. Anyone who's not fighting, not, not sieging there, go and fight this lot. You're not all needed, are you? No, only six. We'll leave the mercenaries. And the rest of you just step off. Easy squish there. And we'll stack up. Along this line, keep the uh, bomb eyes locked into their own country. Into the south of their own country, shall I say. One another siege. Love it. Continue. How many do we need here? Just the six. Let's take away you lot. Why have you moved off that? What have you seen? You have rebels, fair enough. Also, I saw trading in silk, which means we have Asian trade, which means that we're uh, accruing 
a lot more splendor. All right, it's probably about time to. All right, okay. I was going to say it's probably about time to uh, get out now that they've got separatists popping up. But if Bengals are going to squish them, we'll allow that. All right, can we get out of here? Another extension. Well, give us that. Ninety-eight percent overextension, but it brings in a lot of faults. And to me, we can't take any more land; otherwise, we'd we'd be over our. Can we? Let's have a look. War score three percent. Bang on a hundred. No, we'll just take ninety-seven. Plus money. Fine. Okay, so a lot of faults taken there, and we've also opened up opened up access into the interior for our next fight. Next fight we'll be able to get on this fort, this fort, this fort relatively easily. And also the faults that we've taken will contain them. Or should do. Hills, hills, jungle. I don't think I would need you. I'll keep you up for the time being to get rid of the devastation. Yep. Okay. Now let's grab these cores. So I'd say that we have now the upper hand <clears throat> on the Indian Peninsula, the Indian subcontinent I should say. Let's get back to a central location, split our troops up, lick our wounds a little bit. Split out mercenaries if we need. And increase autonomy. Maintenance down. Conversions. Bamanis is no longer a valid rival for us. Revoke your unboggling. Who can we have for the Ottomans? Yes. Most certainly, yes. Actually, no. Left mercenaries, get rid of them, so we don't end up with the uh, the bad events that come with having mercenaries. Let's split you two directly in half, which leaves us with a seven, thirteen, one split. What's that come back with? Both is 27, and our ratio of horse is 60%. Let's trick you both on the coast. Spy limit of 30, spy limit of 25, 20, 31. Alright, you can go there. And our overextension is dangerously high. Yeah, go on then. And let's get you out of there. Okay, so 12 and 15 and 8 and 16. That's not going to work, is it?
So 10 infantry. What did I come up with again? 27. 10 infantry, 17 horse. Really? So I'll just put all of you in there. There you go. 10 to 17. It's more than 60%. Alright, let's take one horse out. Two horses out. Horses out. Feather ruffle claims. Nope. National unrest. National unrest. Mm -mm, nope. So we can just chuck you in there. Oh well. We'll sort it out when we go to war next. For the uh, for the time being, we just need to to sit and do not much. I've done with getting through to Gaja actually. One by Bamanis. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we'll keep Bengal on side for the time being. We'll also embargo the Autodops. And it's probably time. Hey, Jazz. I forget claim on you. It's probably time to head over. And start eating Shamar, Aman, Hejaz, like that, done lot. Nope. And let's have you moving as well. Hydrant right, was discovered, that's fine. Yeah, just come back. Hormuz is doing alright. I suppose if Hormuz has the navy, then they can always get back to their island and uh, I like the wounds and then go again. Moscow versus other religions, mercenary discipline, we don't use mercenaries, not really. So some spread in truth as provinces would be nice, however, we have Mughal artillery. Artillery cost of minus 50%, we don't use much artillery, do we? We could start using it. Go on then. It's a special thing. We might as well. So between our artillery and our horses. I mean it's only cost. It's not... There's no ability there. It's just cost. Why are we losing so much money? Fort maintenance. Yeah, fair enough, we did pick a lot up over here. We'll get rid of you because you're in the flat and you're not going to be used to contained by mice. You're not either, really. You won't. Devastation's gone. Get rid of you. You will, you will, you will. Which means you probably won't. Let's get rid of you. Mandala. Now let's get rid of these two. It right, kicks off a bit more Bamanis next time. We'll swoop in for all of this above the line of forts. And hopefully these three forts should stop Bamanis getting past us into our squishy centre. 
of you. And you, not needed. You're in the mountains, so I'll keep you. You're in the hills, that's alright. You're in the farms. Don't need you. Mountains, good. Good. Yeah, anything over here near the, the Altmans that's in the mountains, we keep. Turn you into a cult. It's time to make some money. Okay, on we go. And we'll split our troops up just so that I'm not taking quite so much attrition. Let's get some manpower back. And we have a loan. And conversions and such. States as well. Do we make them now or do we save them until we've taken more of Bermanis? Because this will be good land down here. We can probably save it. How are we in terms of tech? An 8, 10, 11. And how's this institution getting on? I'm surprised they got off England so quickly. But it has, I suppose, because England has land on the continent, did have land on the continent. No longer does. But no, it's already spread off uh, off England, so. Ottomans, how are you getting them? Who are you fighting? Tucker gets hungry in the Ottoman conquest of Torntal. Who are you fighting? Not many. That's going to be an easy fight for you. Can we nibble a little bit of your bomb whilst you're there? Fully maintained, fully maintained. We might be able to. Same Miltech. What else did you take? Quantity and an innovative. Alright. Splendid. Go up to full maintenance. Really? Farm maintenance. Are we over our limit? Why not? Just because we have uh, we have men to reinforce, of course. Land theft, Ulema. No, fair near the pie. I ain't giving land to anyone. Not just at the moment. I think we have a claim on you. We do. Excellent. Let's go in there and take that. Hi, Jazz. Yeah, we have a claim. You have no allies. Let's go take that as well. Homos, are you out of your war? Nope, still at it. How many do we need for this siege? Just the three. Detach siege, leave one behind. Let's go. Again, just need three, so detach siege. Leave one behind. Let's get it. Let's stack up on Oman. Ready for that to kick off. Uh, so five local autonomy. Local autonomy in 25% uh, local autonomy in one province is not going to make a big difference for someone that's now as big as us. Who's this? Nashid separatist. Why can't you fight your Nashid separatist? What's going on? Okay. Iraq, are you nearly inside us yet? Also, Ottomans. I get them. I 
If we were to declare war on the Ottomans, Bengal wouldn't multiple wars, Ethiopia wouldn't multiple wars, and debt. I would get hit in the rear by Jean Pierre as well. Right. Put the spine work on no guy. We need no guy and Kogant as well. Are you staying here? You are. We we can't allow that, I'm sorry. Actually I'm not even sorry. Although I would like you to go back the way you came. So we'll just contain them for now. Idea cost of minus ten percent for ten years. Splendid. Reward the minus, accept. Peace out here, take your land. Do I need? Now let's get it caught. Alright, it's going back into. Uh, oh man. That's fair enough. A little bit of conversion going. The other ones are starting to fabricate upon us. Well, how rude. All of that, all your money. And we'll grab all of that as well. Where's the autonomy? We didn't really need to, but. I'd rather do it and not have to worry about it. It's not like we're living on the breadline. Although we're not exactly making oodles of money. Do we have somebody in a sea that shouldn't be in there? Level 1, level 1. No, not really. Alright, 20 stack. To the south coast of a man. Everyone else will stack up. Just here. Who? Someone's popped out over there. Fair enough. Oh man. I declare war on you for the conquest of Kinder. Ethiopia wants to come in, but we're, we're not going to bother with them. How many do we need? Just the six. On to the fort. You lot fill in behind. I don't know where all old man's forces are. I haven't seen any of them. Good. Next. Carry on. And someone's dead. Well, we're not going to replace him. We could do with the money. Kind of development if you got no guy. Right, fabricate on that. That's all we need. And the military leader is dead. We'll keep ten on. Oh, yeah, we need nine to siege it anyway. Fair enough. All of you lot stack up behind so you can support. I will finish. Oh, what are you doing? Well, we'll go and help him out anyway. 
He does have a fire shock in general. If a man's not gonna first course. If a man's not going to uh fight his rebels, then it looks like we're gonna have to. We'll finish this uh this war with a man. And then that'll be it. For this episode, ladies and gentlemen. You get around there? You can. Good. Are we at? No. But man, how are you getting on with that war against uh, Vagina Girl? Vagina Girl lost. And what's this? Regiment cost. Well, we're ahead of time in terms of military tech, aren't we? Yes. All right. Let's grab you then. On our onward quest towards idea cost, I think. Yep. Idea cost of minus ten percent, which is stack beautifully on top of idea cost of minus ten percent that we've already got. How many people do you need? Alright, I'll lend you some people. Also, if we have a spare dude, he should really be... ...in Ottoman territory. What claim? Positive spin on things. Oh, I don't care about your opinion of me. If that alliance breaks and it breaks, we'll just go eat them. They were useful against Bomanis, but I think we've now got a handle on Bomanis, especially with the amount of force we took off them in the last war. Now just waiting for force to fall. Poland has a golden era, really? Really, Poland? I'm surprised that Lithuania hasn't broken free of you yet. Oh. They did. Guaranteed by Lithuania. How the tables have turned. Come on, man. Right. A little bit late on that one. Still, we retain control of the siege. And because Hormuz came in from this end, they can't get through this fort and to Sahar. So we'll be able to get on there before they can. Been blockaded. Yeah, a little bit. Not much. Okay. Oh man. This is what we want. I uh, might as well get another claim on you. Just anything. Anything will do. And you come back. I will peace out with. Oh man. Ooh. Who's going to be mega mad here? But man, don't care. Now we don't want homos to be able to grab stuff or fabricate on stuff. So we'll take all the things that you could fabricate on. Uh, you lot just for... Really? Right, we'll leave. We'll leave that in the south. We'll take that. That's not a lot. That'll do. 
We'll get our straight away here. Well, we don't have permanent claims here. <clears throat> so... Yeah. I mean, we can't do to a man what we did to Bermanis and essentially take a, quarter, a third of the country. Um, or maybe not a third in terms of provinces, but a third in terms of war score. Um, we took a lot of forts from Bermanis in that last fight. Make all these calls. And the next fight will be, I'm assuming, no guy before Muscovy properly eats him up. Gazimanka, who are you? We might have to take them out as well. Eat up into no guy, great horde. Sakasia, Gazimanka, just to cut the almonds off here a little bit. Anyway, I've been looking green as always. You lot have an amazing. Join me next time for more with our Moogle playthrough. Starting to get back into the whole EU4 thing. Um, things are starting to click in my mind. It's amazing how much how much you lose when you've not played a game in a while. And why have you left this little bit here? Did the Mamluks have this before? Or... No, not just yet. As soon as they peace out and drop these forts, that's probably going to be the time. In fact, we should probably go and stack up on the uh, on the almonds. Increase the autonomy there. All the places that we can. Anyone else to put in a seat? Deploy wrap. Is he needed? Not really. Could do with the money instead. We have morale of armies if we need. The war exhaustion comes down. Yeah, the corruption comes down. He's alright actually. I mean, his numbers are shit, but. Not bad. Anyway, yes, till next time. Do take care.